I'm Sandy. I'm Leah. And I'm Chris. And today, we're going to do a little experiment. Because we've been thinking about change. So, let's see what change occurs when we mix a pack of these with some of this. Be bigger. I definitely wasn't expecting the change to be quite that big. Oh, uh, me neither. Changes can be pretty big and quite unexpected. But we don't have to be afraid of change, don't we? <laughs> no, we don't. For example, without change, this caterpillar wouldn't turn into this butterfly and this seed wouldn't turn into this great big tree and this chocolate bar wouldn't become this. Loads of things changed at the end of March and soon a lot of things are going to change again but change is actually a really normal part of life and don't worry not all changes are super dramatic and fast like this one. And actually, a lot of the time, changes are pretty slow. And if change scares you and you're worried about all the different changes that have happened recently, the best thing to do is to understand them. So, Sandy the science guy, please can you explain what changes happened when you put a Mento in a bottle of Coca-Cola? Sure thing, there. Now, Mentos have three special ingredients. Sugar, potassium benzoate, and aspartame. Uh, and these ingredients make it much easier for the uh, Coke to produce carbon dioxide bubbles. Now, now, cola is a very bubbly drink already, but when you pop some of these in, uh, the bubbles are produced so quickly that they erupt out of the top, like we just saw. Oh, now I understand why that change happened. Great, now remember, if you find yourself in a situation scarier than putting a Mento in a bottle of Coca-Cola, then remember, try and understand it. Ask questions and learn about what's scaring you and you might find that it helps you.